welcome back to my channel so for today's video I'm going to be doing another eBay haul I'm hoping that you guys like these series so far in my last video which was my first eBay haul that I did upload I just wanted to quickly address a couple things a lot of people were commenting and I was seeing a lot of comments that were saying this saying that I was talking too much Okay, let me just address that real quick so that I don't have to keep repeating myself. That was the first video of this series that I started and there was a lot of information that I wanted to relay to you guys. So I apologize if you guys didn't like the fact that I was talking too much, but you know, some of my videos I am going to talk a lot because I need to tell you guys stuff. So if you guys don't like that I'm talking, then just don't watch my videos because pretty much all my videos are going to have me talking, whether it's a lot or, you know, a little bit, but I like to talk. So when I feel like I have something to say, I'm going to say it to you guys. And I know a lot of people actually like the fact that I was describing everything and talking about it. And for those who are saying that I talk a lot, you guys keep in mind that not everybody knows what AliExpress is and they aren't familiar with the website or any of their products so I was trying to be descriptive so that if people do order they know how and stuff like that so sorry to those that didn't like that I was talking I will try to keep these videos just to the haul but that was the first one so that's why I talked a lot and another thing I've seen that a lot of people were asking where the links were you guys this is why it's important for you guys to listen to what I say because it's annoying when I have to like keep repeating myself a lot of people kept asking for the where the Kylie lip kits and I specifically stated in the description and in the beginning of the video that YouTube does not allow me to post links to the fake items so if you guys want to find links to the fake items that I share then you guys need to go to my blog which is always linked down below and I will have all the links to all those products on my blog it will never be in the description below unless it is like just regular items I will always have those linked but for the fake items they will be linked on my blog so yeah this is why I talk a lot because there's information that I need to provide for you guys so that you guys will know where stuff is so yeah if you guys want to see what I got in today's haul, then just go ahead and keep on watching. Okay, so first I am going to start out with the stuff that is um, like not replica or anything like that. Just so the people that don't like the replica items don't have to sit here and watch. So for the first few things I got were a few pairs of sunglasses. I've been obsessed with the sunglasses on Allie and um, I love sunglasses just in general. And they're so inexpensive, so... The first pair I got were these black aviators. They just like this. I think they look super cute. Well, at least not with this hairstyle, but um, they normally look really cute. I really like these. The next ones are really, really fun, and I normally wouldn't wear glasses like this, but I saw them and thought they were super cute. But it's these gold cat eye looking glasses. I think they look really cute. Um, I will say that I did wear them, and it doesn't give you too much protection from the sun. If you're planning on getting these for like the beach or like to keep the sun out of your eyes, I really wouldn't recommend these these are just more um, to wear because they look cute and then the last pair I got are these super cute rose gold aviators they are rose gold and then they are reflective of like green and like a pinky color for the lenses but I absolutely love them I got these nail tips I want to start doing my own nails so I just bought these off alley these are the clear tips when I'm just doing like a plain like nail polish or anything like that I love to get um, these clear ones instead of getting the white tip because they just look a lot better and I have used them they aren't my favorite they are kind of hard to work with um, so I think I'm gonna go ahead and order like a different brand next time next I got the me now long-lasting lip though I got two of these I got one red one and one um, like nudie color for this video um, I have a lot of lip products so I'm not gonna swatch any of them but on my blog I will have swatches there for you so go ahead and check that out they're, they're really pretty and really pigmented and literally guys they will stay on your lips all day these are made in um, China or whatever so I'm not really sure of the ingredients but I have never had a reaction and I really do like them they're great quality I picked up some more of my favorite eyelashes from eBay I always use these in my videos these are the 014 lashes they just look like this they are 100% real mink lashes I'm not sure if they're actually real but 
that's what they say. I picked up five because I was running low. Okay, and then I picked up some of these glitters. Um, I was looking on Urban Decay and I want to get the glitter from them, but it's like $20 for a tube. So I was just like, eh, I don't really spend $20 on a glitter. I'm not going to use a lot. So I saw these on Ali, and these are humongous. They actually look bigger like in person than they did on the website but I got a gold a silver and then this like clear pink iridescent one it's like super pretty and these are really pigments and sticking with the nail trend I got these little like pearl I don't know if you're gonna be able to see this there's these pearl little jewels for my nails I picked up a five pack of this nail glue I've seen a couple like do-it-yourself nail tutorials and a lot of girls have used this glue and said it works amazing so um, I picked this up actually on eBay. Another thing I got on Ali was just this little brush right here. Um, let's go ahead and take it out. It's just a facial brush. I like to do a lot of masks and um, sometimes I don't like using my fingers, you know, because cross-contamination, stuff like that. So. And then the last couple things that I got that is um, not replica is these liquid lipsticks from Magic Effect. I got a really pretty red color, a purple color, and this really nice mauve like, it's coming off like purple red, but it's like a mauve toned. Um, these are really pigmented. Um, this one was a little bit streaky when I swatched it. I'm not really sure how long they last on the lips because I have not tried them on my lips yet, but they do say they are waterproof and long lasting. I've seen a lot of Ally videos and I've never heard anybody talk about these, so... Um, if they do work out, I will probably get more. And just for you guys, if you guys want to pick these up, I got it in the shade 07, 05, and 04. Okay, now moving on to all my replica stuff. I did pick up some more Kylie lip kits. These were the ones that I was hoping to get so I can share it in my last video, but I didn't end up getting any, so I got all of these ones. I accidentally ordered two of the 22, um, so this is just an extra one. It's really good. It's like the same quality as the last one. And then I got um, this pack. It came in a set. It was about $8. Um, this one is a Freedom, Skyly, and Exposed. I will say right now that I did ask for a refund for these because wait till I'm gonna just show you really quickly I didn't care that the boxes came ruined because I mean they always come ruined they aren't too bad but they are a little bit squished but guys these colors are just ridiculously like off like do you guys see this as like are you serious right now this does not even look even if different in different lighting, which is so funny because I messaged the seller and I told her that they were off and she was like, okay, dear. Um, she said something about, oh, maybe it's just your lighting. Like, no, it is not my lighting, honey. No, like this is completely off. It doesn't matter if you, you know, made it a lighter and like or bright. It does not matter. This is way off. So... I just thought this was so funny because it looks purple. That is not blue. And both of my liners on these came broken. And even the end, I mean, the end doesn't look too bad, but it's definitely not the color it's supposed to be. With Exposed, this one was like really funny to me. Uh, this is like an orange. Like it almost looks like a brown, an orangey brown and the liner totally off. So I was like so mad. This isn't even like a cute color. If it was like a nice color, I would have been like, okay, whatever. I'll just order another one. But it's not even like flattering. Okay, this this lip liner is fine. I was so excited to try these and then I got them and they're just totally off. Like, do you guys see this? Like, yeah, this is so ridiculous. So I did ask for a refund and finally after arguing back and forth with her, she finally agreed to give me it. And I was really surprised with this one. This is the um, Dead of Night and this pigmentation is crazy. I've seen a lot of people get like really bad ones, but this is like completely black. It's not gray or anything like that. And even the lip liner, the lip liner came intact and the lip liner is freaking creamy as shit. 
I could use this as eyeliner if I wanted to. And then I did pick up the LA Splash Cosmetics Liquid Lipsticks. I got four of them. The shade Ghoulish, which looks like this. And I love the packaging. It's gold. I'll probably display it back here somewhere. This is Honey Blown. This is a weird color. I don't know how to describe it, but it's just a weird brown. I got Malevolent. Malevolent? I don't even know. But this is a really pretty, like, mauve tone color. I have swatched these and applied them on my lips, and they do seem really nice. And this is, like, a pinky nude. And then they also sent me, I don't know if this was, like, a free gift or because, like, my package took forever. But I got this uh, KOD lipstick. It just looks like this um, in the shade 03. So, I mean, I'm not going to use this, but it was free. Next, I have some lipsticks from MAC that are fake obviously um this first one is rebel and it just looks like this like the original mac packaging and here's the shade it actually looks a lot like rebel i could totally tell that these are fake because the packaging is just so light and airy so if you guys ever come across somebody who's selling mac and you're not really sure they're definitely going to be like light packaging so okay this is the second one i got and this is in the shade lady danger and this is supposed to be like a really really like not a bright red, but like a bright to dark red. I don't know how to describe it, but it, it's actually pink. So um, I'm going to talk to the seller about that one because I was like, what? No. The next one I got is Russian Red. And I actually want to pick the real one up of this color because it's so beautiful. Same packaging and just looks like this. Russian Red is a little bit like a deeper red. And this is more of like a brick red to me. So... Not the exact color, but like I said, I haven't swatched these yet because I need to take pictures from my blog first. Um, so I'm not sure if maybe it'll come off like the real color or not. And then the last one I got is Cushy Kiss. I don't even know if this is a real MAC lipstick. I ordered like two different ones and had to pick two different ones because they were like, like the first time one was broken and then the, the next one I picked, it was like sold out. So... I just picked this one up. Not really a fan of the color. It looked different on the website, but whatever. So because the packaging took so long, they had to resend it out. And then they also um, didn't have the lipstick I wanted. They gave me this free lipstick right here, which I'm not mad about. This is the Retro Matte Liquid Lip Color. And I actually do want to order some of these because I heard a lot of good things about them. Um, this is in the shade Matte A73. There's like no name or anything. But I'll go ahead and swatch this. These look so promising. They look so nice. So I think I am going to get more of these. Then I forget which order this came in, but I did receive another free gift. This was uh, a MAC Gambalista Valley lipstick in the shade of Whirl, it says on the top. But I don't even know if that's like the real name. But it was from this line. MAC came out with it a while ago. And yeah, it's in the shade Matte Whirl. It just looks like this. I got some ColourPop eyeshadows. I will quickly swatch these for you. This is like legit, um, almost the same packaging except the back is all white and ColourPop packaging is not like that. I love ColourPop eyeshadows and I do have the real ones. So when I found these, um, I obviously know that they're $5 and I know a lot of people are like, why would you go and buy fake ColourPop when they're only $5? But you actually save a lot of money if you just buy the fake ones because these are legit and I don't know how they do it but these are exactly like the ColourPop like the formula the like printed everything is the same so quickly I'll just swatch one swatch this is like one swatch like do you see how pigment like it's amazing how they clone these I literally want to buy all the ColourPop eyeshadows just to have them in my collection not necessarily to like use them so that is why I am buying all of them on Ali because I don't want to spend like 300 bucks buying the real eyeshadows when I could just get the fake one. So this next one right here is called I Love This. This one, this purple one was called Dance Party. Now I'm not sure if these names and these colors are the exact same ones as ColourPop has. This next one is this really shimmery one. This one, um does not have the same consistency as the others but it is still pigmented as you can see this is the next one right here this is in the shade moonshine this is a really pretty color this next one is mooning it's a really pretty like champagne -y bronze color this one is really really smooth that one right there next one is hustle 
This is in the shade uh, Slave to Pink. Is that? The last one is Cheap Date. That is that one right there. And then the last things that I have are these NYX um, lingerie lipsticks. I have the whole collection and there are 12 of them. Five of them I bought on eBay and five of, and the rest I bought on um, Ali. So I got these shades um, Push Up. This is Ruffle Trim. Embellishment. Lace Detail. Beauty Mark. Corset. Baby Doll. Satin Ribbon, Honeymoon, and the last one I got is Bedtime Flirt. These are so amazing. These are probably my favorite liquid lipsticks out of all the liquid lipsticks I have. The formula is literally just like the original, if not better. So if you guys want a lip swatch video of these lipsticks on my lips and two of the real ones, comment in the down bar and then everybody try to like that comment. So yeah guys, that is everything that I have to share with you guys for today. I hope I didn't talk too much and I hope this wasn't such a long video. Um, if you guys really don't like me talking and describing the items and stuff, Stuff like that please let me know how you guys want me to film these um, I can film them just like displaying them and show them in the camera and just kind of like do a slide of like what I think of them if you guys want you know let me know if you guys do like me I'm sitting here explaining my thoughts on the products as I show them to you just let me know because it's a two-way street. I obviously film these videos for you guys. I didn't know I'm Puerto Rican and Puerto Ricans talk a lot and they're very loud so just keep that in mind guys that I'm not trying to be annoying and I definitely get annoyed with myself hearing me talk a lot so you're not the only ones um but yeah so I do apologize for that I will try to get better and not talk so much if you guys are new and just seeing this video for the first time then please go check out some of my other AliExpress hauls I will leave them down below and also be sure to subscribe to my channel for more AliExpress hauls and other fun videos and stuff like that so yeah, I think that's everything for today I have to share with you guys. So thank you guys so much for watching. And until next time, I will see you guys in my next one. Bye.